How do y'all back today with a another short haul video? We'll just get started here. Everything just put into super fresh brand new mylar. I just hit the mail today. This is of course Amazing Adventures number 12. Um very nice copy kind of a uh, very finish thing killer Gil Kane cover of course I just wanted it back in the collection so I got it oh snap Avengers number 96, classic Neil Adams, magnificent, uh, magnificent, uh, kind of a fine plus affair, it's got a little crunch up here, but I can live with that, it doesn't break color or anything, so, and again, you know, I buy these books uh, with the the notion of an old timer uh, who finds uh, prices in the modern age just shocking. So I got this. You know, if if I can get books of this quality for you know ten or fifteen or eighteen bucks. That's fine with me. I, I accept that as the reality of the day. So there you go. Avengers 96. What's next? Oh my goodness. Amazing Spider-Man number 33. Oh hell yeah. Um, you'll notice on all of these books there is just beautiful centering and y'all know me that is my number one criteria um, regardless of grade this is a nice copy though nothing to sneeze at got it for a good price glad to have it back in the collection What's next? Oh, well. Now look at this. Uh, this is the first copy of my beloved Thor 207 that I have sought out for a while. It's been a couple of years since I sought out the high grade perfectly centered books but this thing is just so magnificent look at that centering absolute bullseye couple of very minor spine ticks but there you go a smashing copy of Thor 207 all right what else have we got here oh my Captain America 116 this is a book I've never had um, kind of separates it from all the other books in this little stack but uh, I've just been coveting it for years and years and years and years. This is a nice uh, kind of very fine-ish affair. And there's the real reason I bought it. Great date stamp. It's clean, beautifully white. Uh, very nicely centered. Even though it has that uh, eighth of an inch white strip, 
the white strip itself is perfect, right? Okay, Gene Colon kicking some ass here. Alright, three more, I think. Yeah, three more. The Flash, 195. This is a book that I remember fondly. Uh, my mother brought it home from her hairdressers uh, back around 1975. Um, her hairdresser's son was a comic reader and evidently she would uh, get some of the books from from her son's collection um, put them out you know on the reading tables and she and my mother got to talking and she offered my mother some of the books and this is one that my mom brought home to me great great Neil Adams cover um, dig the centering and all that right again you've got that one sixteenth of an inch white strip but it in an end and of itself is beautiful right okay two more what do we got ah Doc Savage number four another smashing Bronze Age Gil Kane cover beautifully centered um, probably a very fine very fine minus affair um, the worst thing is the that little chipping of color there but again I bought this copy for let's say it together folks the date stamp beautiful beautiful number yes okay bright okay last book oh snap oh snap Conan the Barbarian number one I have been threatening for a couple of years to put together uh, another uh, run of Barry Smith's Conan and I saw this the other day threw out a best offer and got it and again you can see why perhaps I chose this coffee copy the centering is just beautiful it's uh, is really as good as you can get on this book um, just the way it is so I suppose I am going to put together that second set of Barry Smith's Conan run hey all right gang thanks for watching We'll see you later. Bye-bye.